Hi, I'm David the Bruce, visualhollywood.com, Femme Century Movie Reviews. Today we're taking a look at Blue Jay. Blue Jay, one of the production companies on this, is Netflix. Netflix is really getting into the movie business big time. Instead of getting a license to do something that, that was, you know, by Warner Brothers or 20th Century, what they're doing is now producing their own. I think eventually um, <clears throat> Netflix is going to be mostly their stuff. And boy, they've got... You know, just they got a lot of good stuff. Luke Cage just just started as I'm doing this. It's just got a lot of good stuff. Anyway, that's not what I really want to talk about. I want to talk about Blue Jay and Blue Jay. Oh man, if you've ever fallen in love or if you've ever run into old friends and you kind of wonder where your relationship with them, let's say, let's say from high school or something like that, this is the film for you. If you have a heart that beats, you <laughs> you're gonna feel something inside when you watch Blue Jay. It's very very few uh, actors in this, and it's a very simple plot. But the genius of it is the performance of the actors, and I'm talking about Mark Duplass and particularly Sarah Paulson. Unbelievable. People are already saying that Sarah Paulson, as she plays Amanda in this, should be uh, um, nominated for all sorts of awards. The, it, the performance is that good. So we're, we're going to see what happens. Basically, the story is two high school sweethearts who've moved out of their small town just happen to come back into that small town for different reasons and they run into each other. Jim, played by Mark Duplass, he's there because his mother has died and he's going through all the family stuff and just trying to bring it. Well, you, you get the point. And then uh, Sarah Paulson, she plays Amanda. She has a sister who's suddenly pregnant and so she's come back to the town to, to be with her sister during this you know monumental moment in her life and uh then uh, uh, uh jim and amanda just happen to bump into each other at the grocery store small town sure absolutely and uh they're kind of reluctant. I mean, it's, it's a little bit of reluctance in their characters uh, just coming into it. But you can also tell that there's something profoundly deep about their connection. So what is that all about? And they start to rekindle old flames. Ah, I'm not going to tell you what happens. Will they absolutely fall in love with each other? What happens? But I will tell you what will happen. You will fall in love with this film. Yes, you will. I'm David the Bruce.